Mina. Good morning. Good morning. Say happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> you ready to eat some papa? Woohoo! Happy Thanksgiving. Okay, I'll see you later. I'm gonna go lift some weights. I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll be back. Yo, what is goody everybody? Welcome back to another video. And you're watching this right now on Thanksgiving, so I know you're probably stuffing your face with some dressing, some sweet potato pie, some mashed potatoes, some gravy. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Unfortunately for me, it is uh, Wednesday, so technically not Thanksgiving, but it will be tomorrow. So anyways, guys, we are gonna do a full day of eating and we're about to go lift. Yes, I'm gonna go lift in the morning. I have not lifted in the morning in like months. It's been a super long time. I'm fasted, we're about to go hit back, so it's gonna be fun. So enough, wait, 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 wait. I was gonna say enough talking. Wait, Logan, slow down, reverse that. If you're watching this right now, you know what that means. That means that you woke up somewhere, so that means that you are winning. So are you stressed? Are your problems? Can it phase you? Can it phase me? And that was backwards because I have dyslexia, but it's all good because you and I are already winning, fam. Absolutely love you. As you can see, I'm in a great mood because I'm about to go see my family tomorrow. It's all about family and I absolutely love it. And we're about to go to the gym. Um, comment down below, do I need to chill or do you love my energy? Okay, let's go to the gym. All right guys, so we're in the gym, but before we get started, I have to thank the sponsors of this video, and that's gonna be Fat Snacks Cookies, sugar-free, keto-friendly, zero net carbs, super delicious. You guys know I've talked about this all the time, and if you follow me on Instagram, you know I always sneak them into the movies, because they're very small, and so, hey man, you know the movies don't have no keto snacks, so it's like a perfect little snack you put in your fanny pack, and no one ever knows, so there you go. So yes, shout out to Fat Snacks for sponsoring this video. As always guys, links in the description below. Now, guys, so I get a lot of DMs on like how to build mass. What are the best exercises to do to build mass? And what I like to call them are the big six. It took me a long time to realize this, guys. When I got into the gym, I was doing all types of crazy exercises, right? Like all these machines, all this assisted uh, pull-ups and whatnot, and I really wasn't building mass. Sure, I was feeling the pump, but I wasn't getting any bigger, I wasn't getting any stronger. It wasn't until I discovered compound lifts and the big six, bench press, squat, deadlifts, overhead press, pull-ups, and bent over rows. Those are my big six workouts to do if you're trying to build mass and trying to build strength. So, you know what, I said it's back day and I said I wasn't gonna perform all these exercises, but you know what, screw it, I'm gonna do it. It's Thanksgiving, this is gonna be a Thanksgiving special for you guys, so I'm gonna perform the big six and show you the exercises you should be doing. If you're not doing these exercises, you need to start doing them today. Incorporate them into your workout routine, so enough talking, let's get started. First compound lift is gonna be pull-ups. Um, if you're not able to do pull-ups yet, it's okay to do assisted pull-ups. Uh, once you graduate from there and you're able to do body weight push-ups, uh, body weight pull-ups like so, then you're gonna graduate to weighted pull-ups and that's where I'm at right now. And then you just keep going up and up. So first off, I like to just start off, just warm up with some body weight. All right guys, so first working set, we got a weighted uh, 25 right here. We're gonna try to do as many as we can. I'll tell you what, if you could do 10, you need to move up. If you could probably do eight, you probably need to move up. So up the weight, here we go, first, first set. Okay guys, so next up on the big six is gonna be bent over rows. If you're familiar with this channel, you guys know I absolutely love bent over rows. I always incorporate it in my back days, and it's always the first exercise as well. Now, one thing guys, when you do bent over rows, it's all about control. Too many times I see people just swinging it, swinging it, because they can't control it. What that tells me is that you have to lighten the weight, okay? It's all about lighten the weight, being able to control it. Hold that contraction, then boom. That's the thing with compound lifts, guys. That's why they build so much muscle, is because they cause so much muscle fiber tension. You, you're using almost your full body, right? That's the thing with compound lifts. You're almost using everything, upper body and lower body when you do these exercises. So that's why I absolutely love bent over rows. All about controlling it, so let's go. Woo. 
All right, guys, so this is gonna be the third exercise of the big six, and it's gonna be squats, man. Squats is one of like the best compound lifts you can do to build mass, to build mass. Not only does it help you get bigger, get stronger, it's also gonna help build up your testosterone. Yes, I know that sounds crazy. It will help with building up your testosterone. So here we go. We're gonna do a couple sets now. Obviously, guys, yes, I'm not doing a lot of weight. I actually did squats yesterday, but if you are new to this channel, you, there is a chalkboard up there with the top squatters, top three squatters on the board. Obviously, you can't see it because we're too far, but I'm number three on there, okay? So don't judge me on this. I'm just showing you guys to demonstrate the exercise. Um, here we go. Guys, and don't do no half squats, okay? Get your ass to the grass. Here we go. Okay, so the thing with squats, guys, like everything else, like all these compound lifts that we're doing, if you can do it more than 10 times, up the weight, okay? Up the weight, that's how you're gonna get bigger, that's how you're gonna get stronger. It's called progressive overload. If you come in here every single week and you do the same thing, you're not gonna get any stronger, okay? So progressive overload, if you can do it eight to 10 times, add a little bit more weight and keep going up and up until you can't go anymore and then you work from there. All right, guys, exercise number four is gonna be overhead press. I like to do it with dumbbells, but you can do it with barbells. I just prefer dumbbells. It feels a lot better on my shoulders, uh, but these are key to building that big upper uh, shoulders, you know, those bolder shoulders just popping. 3D shoulders that gives you that, just that really good look. So here we go. <sighs> Woo! Yes, sir. My jam. Woo! Okay, exercise number five. We're almost done. This is going to be deadlifts. Now, the thing with me, guys, I like to sumo deadlift, but it's totally up to you. You can do conventional, which is like this. I'll show you conventional. That's conventional or you can do sumo. I just like sumo, it just feels better, and it's something I've been doing, so I'm gonna do sumo, just like this. Okay guys, so that is deadlift, that is compound lift number five. Deadlift is one of those things, guys, you're gonna feel it all over your body. You're gonna feel it on your back, you're gonna feel it on your quads, Depending what you do, either conventional or sumo, uh, you're fitting in your hamstrings or you're fitting in your quads. Uh, it's a great, great compound lift. If you're not doing deadlifts in your workout routine, you need to add it today. Not tomorrow, today. Okay, so one more exercise. Actually, the last exercise, so let's go do the damn thing. All right, I know some of you are getting scared. I know some of you are getting scared. You thought I wasn't gonna bring it up, but I hate to let you down. Uh, we got the bench press, guys. Bench press is one of the best lifts that you can do just to build that chest, build that bigger and thicker chest. Here we go, we're about to knock out 315 for a couple of reps. Let's get it, baby. I love bench press, man. I love it. Ah. 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 All right, guys, there we go. That is the big six right there to build strength, to build mass. If you're not doing any of these in your daily routine, like I said, you need to incorporate them. They're just compound lists, guys. Google it, compound lists. Why they're, why they're so helpful, why they're so key to building up mass. It just calls everything. Like, not only when I did that bench press right there, I could feel it in my legs. 
they just cause so much muscle fibers to be working and just shooting off contractions. They're awesome, man. So anyways, trying to catch my breath. But there you go, guys. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. But like I said, those are the top six muscle builders. Whew, I think it's time to eat now. Good spot for you. Yeah, I think French classical music. So she comes of age around I'm gonna get it to go. Okay, what so, can we get you? Uh, let's get some brisket. Let's get a half pound of brisket, a rib. Let's get a sausage. I can cut it out, bro. Yeah, no problem. I appreciate it, man. They're good. Where have you been? How's the family? They're good, they're good. Yeah. All right, guys, don't be jealous. It is going down, as you can see. Actually, you know what? I should probably do a thumbnail picture. One moment. Sorry about that. Every time I'm searching for a good thumbnail, I can never find one because I'm way too shaky with the camera when it comes to like I finally get a good thumbnail and it's all blurry. So didn't want to make that same mistake. So as you can see, guys, we got pepper jack cheese, my favorite. We got shredded jalapeno sausage. We got one pork rib. One thing I love about Hayes County Barbecue is they don't put any sugar on any of their meats uh, except their pulled pork. Uh, sandwiches obviously it's, it's gonna have a little bit of a barbecue sauce so um, that's the only thing they put it on that's why I absolutely love Hayes County barbecue we got brisket as you can see and then we got the avocado and you know I'm gonna reach behind me and get the Redmond's real salt for my avocado and that is it guys this is gonna be meal number one It is about to go down don't be jealous get your ass to Texas and get some Hayes County barbecue let's eat and so fast forward a couple of hours, uh, it's gonna be time for the second meal of the day. And I'm gonna go with these lean muscle meals. Uh, these are made by Flex Pro Meals. So Flex Pro Meals sent me out like this big box of these keto meals. Uh, I mean, I guess you can call them keto meals, but they're a little higher than protein. So I would say like low carb meals. So like for this one, this is the uh, keto Mongolian beef. This one's really, really good. Five carbs, 45 protein, 25 fat. This one is the chicken parm. Um, 50 grams of protein, 20 carbs, 20 fat. So really good convenient meals. You guys know I say this all the time, it's all about convenience. And so I'm definitely not gonna tell any company who wants to send me free meals to not send me meals. Please send me free meals, less cooking, less spending money. So like I said, shout out to Flex Pro Meals for sending me out. I actually uh, told them to give me a discount because I posted it on my Instagram and a lot of people were asking me like, yo, like what's your discount code? So if you use discount code Goody, you get 20% off your first order. So like I said, man, the meals are really, really good and super convenient. They send you a big box, you freeze them up, Take them out of the freezer whenever you want to cook them the next day. Put them in your refrigerator or let them thaw out. So I took these out this morning, um, let them thawed out, and so they're ready to go. Put them in the microwave. Two minutes later, bada bing, bada boom, boom, you got some good meals. So let's cook these two up. So let's eat. We got the uh, Mongolian beef, just pretty much just chopped up sirloin with some veggies. Uh, we got the chicken parmesan with a little bit of marinara sauce and some cauliflower rice. Like I said, very convenient macros are right there. Very easy to put into my fitness pal. And like I said, man, you can't beat the convenience. I mean, just simply take it out of the freezer, put it in the microwave, and you're good to go. I would say uh, the Mongolian beef is for sure quickly one of my favorites. Now, the chicken parmesan, I mean, it's pretty simple. Like, it's pretty cut and dry, right? A little bit of marinara sauce, pretty much chicken breast. The cauliflower mashed potatoes needs a little bit of salt, but that's all good. I put my own salt on there. And like I said, good meals, very easy, convenient. Um, so yeah, this is meal number two. Oh no, look who's home from <laughs> grandma's house. Woo <laughs> la What, you being shy? You being shy? What's up? Oh, you just want your jumbo now? What's up? What's yeah, up? What's she up? was sleepy. Either. Come here. Come hi. here. Hi. <laughs> Did you say hi to Mina? Hey, say hi to I Mina. Missed you. Hey, give me a kiss. 
Hey, give me, give me, go back. I missed you. I missed you, silly girl. I missed you. I missed you. Just hire your sister. Uh, oh, no. Give her a kiss. No, no, give her a kiss. Kiss, 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 kiss. Oh, no. Give her a kiss. Oh, Thank right. you. High five. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Guys, so on to the final meal of the night. Now, I was planning on cooking this uh, porterhouse on my Auto Wild grill, but your boy Goody Beats forgot to fill up the propane, and so yeah, now I have to cook it on this uh, iron cast, which is not bad. I mean, it is what it is, but I want I want to utilize my freaking uh, my my new grill so I can get better at it because I have still yet to cook the perfect steak on it, but it's all good. Okay, guys, sorry about that. The battery died mid sentence, so. Like I was saying, just adding on some pepper and probably a little bit of Redmond's real salt. I'm gonna go ahead and use this kosher salt. It's a little bit bigger uh, than the fine salt. Actually, it's gonna take a little time to come out. All right, there we go. Bada bing, bada boom. It is what it is, whatever. So I'm gonna let this cook for a little bit. I'm gonna try not to burn it, but before we complete it, let me know in the comments below, am I gonna burn the steak? Will I burn the steak? Let me know in the comments. Okay, so I'm gonna cook this and then I'll show you how it is after I'm done. Okay, I don't think I burnt it, guys. I truly, truly don't think I burnt it. So here we go, here we go. Look at that. And I always thought like, hey, you know what? I guess it's better to undercook a steak if you're one of those people who like it medium rare than to overcook a steak and then have it come out like a hockey puck. But I'm gonna go sit down with Baby Lo and eat the steak uh, while we watch Frozen. Yeah, look at this juicy steak. I think Lola wants that. Juicy, is it hot? You touch it, it feels hot. You want some? It's hot. It's not hot. hot. Oh, it's a little warm, it's a little warm. Here, Let I'll blow it for you. Who, 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 who. Lola, we've probably watched Frozen 50 times already. If you made it this far, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Baby Lo appreciates it. Camila appreciates it. Crystal, who's holding the camera, yeah. appreciates it. And I just want to tell you happy Thanksgiving from my family to yours. Have a great day. I hope you're having a great day so far. Don't stress about food. Don't stress about macros. Don't stress about whether it's keto friendly. Just enjoy the moments. Enjoy the memories. Enjoy the time with the family. Enjoy time with Baby Lo. I'm going to enjoy time with Camila. Her first Thanksgiving. Woohoo! Are you gonna eat lots of turkey tomorrow? Hey, eat the She's meat. She's like, give me eat the, the steak. Ah, oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, eat the meat. Ah, oh, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, so anyways, like guys, have an awesome, awesome yeah. Thanksgiving. I love you guys. We'll see y'all in the next video. Peace. Say peace, Lola. Peace. 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 peace.